This morning, the Michigan State Police Sergeant charged in the death of Samuel Sterling is set to make his first appearance in court. Now, those charges against Detective Sergeant Brian Keeley were announced last week by Michigan Attorney General Dana Nessel. Fox 17's Lauren Coomer is joining us live this morning right outside of courts where his arraignment should be scheduled there. Good morning, Lauren. Yeah, good morning to you. Detective Sergeant Keeley resigned just days after Attorney General Dana Nessel announced charges on second degree murder and involuntary manslaughter. It all dates back to April 17th when Keeley, who was part of a task force, was trying to arrest 25 year old Samuel Sterling for absconding parole. Sterling was hit and seriously injured by an unmarked Michigan State Police cruiser that Keeley was driving, Sterling dying later that day from his injuries. We've since learned Keeley has retired from MSP and will soon start receiving a pension. Cooley Law School professor Emeritus and former MSP trooper Lewis Langham explains Keeley being charged has no effect on him being eligible for retirement. He earned that pension prior to the actions taking place. So more than likely, whatever the outcome of this trial is, it shouldn't have any effect on his pension. If he retires, the clock starts ticking administratively to get the pension started and he doesn't have to rely upon being off work, not receiving any type of benefits whatsoever as it relates to um, uh, a paycheck. Langham tells us Keeley's pension should start 30 days after he applied for retirement. Now, again, he is set to appear in court for his arraignment this morning here at the Kentwood District Court. It is set to start at 9 a.m. And we, of course, will bring you updates both on air and online. For now, we'll send it back to you in the studio reporting live in Kentwood. I'm Lauren Coomer, Fox 17 News. Lauren,